All right, guys, going to the beach. Oh no, there's a train stop there. Uh, should we wait for the train or talk to the engineer that I'm across? What are they hauling today? Oh my goodness, there's some Boeing, Boeing Fuse Lodge. I think those are 737 Fuse Lodge. I haven't seen them in a while. Let's see if we can cross. Well, I made it across. Here's a better look at the Fuse Lodge. This looks like they're hauling four or five of the Boeing 737 Fuse Lodges. at the beach people just hanging out chilling at the beach haven't seen these in a while Let's see 8417 pretty sure that's the size of a Boeing 737 before it's painted that's why it's green metallic color before the paint job Like this one's probably for cargo or the military. See, there's no windows right here. See, yeah, spare see aero systems. Right now and then, but I've never seen it come Nine six zero. With one of these ones on. Yeah, the that's the first. And before it's painted. See, here is passenger fuse lodge eight four two seven. Here's 8429. Looks like somebody forgot to tape over that window though. <laughs> See? What if like animals or birds can fly into it? Can happen. That's weird. And here's 8426, the fifth one. See how the window's taped up? It's definitely 3 7 size. Count the windows. If I didn't count wrong, there are 44 windows on each side. Here's a view from the rear. Wait, what airplane is that flying? Kind of looks like a 7X7, but my guess is a 777X doing an aerial flight test. A long possession sound. See with the Mogatio ferry just doing a circle flight test. I guess they have to log so many hours. So there's a reason why the fuse lodge is right after the locomotive. Be one, because it's the most expensive, they want to keep an eye out on it. And two, why I'm thinking about that, I want to make a correction. Actually that is a 737 MAX, I think that's doing the flight test, not a 777X. It's like what it before. And second, so it's easier to disconnect to allow another set of trains to come and take this away to the Boeing plant. All right, so I have to head back. I couldn't wait until they moved the train out of the way. So this is the best vantage point from here. Until next time, hope you guys enjoy the video.